Okay, Raymond, you're uh, a fan of Glasgow Rangers. Yes. Uh, we're here in, uh, uh, in Edinburgh to see the match between the um, Rangers. Can you tell us some, some words about the uh, Algerian player Bouguera? Uh, the thing is, a very good player, uh, a cultured player. His first touch is not your stereotypical player that you're used to seeing in Scotland. I think he's a, a very good footballer, as we would say. Um, he plays more with the head rather than the heart. That's, that's, that's just my opinion. Others may think different. But, yeah. so. so, as player, what's uh, his qualities? He's passing and he's, uh, his defensive awareness. He knows when to tackle and when to avoid tackling, I think. So you think he's a good player for Rangers? Yes, yes. I don't think he'll be there long though. I think someone will buy him and we can't afford to keep him. So that happens in football, unfortunately. So. OK, thank you. OK, you're welcome. So, uh, Mr. Kellen Duncan from uh, Daily Record, Rangers. Uh, can you tell us some few words about Bo Majid Bouguera players? Yeah, he's probably been uh, Rangers' best player this season. Uh, you know, they, when, when he's not been playing, when he was out injured, they, they missed him. And, and when he was away on in international duty, he never came back on time. Uh, uh, they, they really missed him. He's, you know, he's probably the strongest defender in the, the Scottish Premier League. Uh, but also, he's also added a lot to his game, uh, attacking-wise. You know, going forward, he, he scored a lot of goals from from set pieces. Uh, and he's also set up a lot of goals. He likes to get forward. Um, you saw today in the game against Hibs, you know, when the, when the game was close, it was 1-1 and he, he stayed forward from a corner kick and uh, he set up the goal for Chris Boyd to make it 2-1. Uh, that changed the match and then Rangers went on easily to win 4-1 after that. Okay. He's going to miss him for the African Cup of Nations? Yeah, he will have a big blow, but I, th I, think, uh, I think it has been sorted out that he will play against Celtic. Uh, next week before he if he, before he goes away so th so that is a big boost for rangers uh, that he's able to play in, in arguably the biggest game of the season the hardest game it is uh, it is away to celtic at parkhead so that's the, the toughest game that rangers will face so so there's a big uh, bonus that he can uh, he can play in that game next week before he goes goes away to to the african nations cup um, yeah they, they will definitely miss him when he goes away there's no doubt about that well, i think it's a, it's a good deal for rangers uh, to get have him uh with the Rangers, uh, I think it's a good deal made the Rangers made with uh, this with player. Charlton to yeah. when they signed him, yeah, yeah, they have a great, you know, two point five million is a uh, great value for money. Uh, when you look at the, the current transfer market, you know, you won't get many top class uh, players who cost two point five million. So, you know, and he's he's done well in Scotland. Yeah, a lot of people say that's not the best league, but he's also done very well in the Champions League as well. You know, against Stuttgart and Sevilla, he showed that he can uh, he can play against some of the better players in Europe. So yeah, um, it is uh, a very very good value. Okay, thank you.